the work-life balance is going to be key to your success and in today's world where you can never get away from it with mobile devices you have to work at it. Balance is important and I learned my lesson years ago um, I did not have good work-life um, balance and it cost me a lot so I have gotten to the point where um, again it goes back to prioritizing all of the projects and that's the personal projects and it's the business projects and then sometimes they have to crisscross on the list. For us here at National Pork Board, we're very, very lucky that they really do promote um, a work-life balance. And so they want us to make sure that we're getting our jobs done, but also want us to be involved in the community. So coming fresh out of the gate, when you can't commit to something 100%, it's okay to say no. Um, it, maybe it's, I can't do it now, but I'd like to do it another time. I think when I first graduated, I said yes to everything. And, oh, someone needs me to judge this, and someone needs me to speak at this class. And as I've gotten a little bit older, I've, I've taken the time to say, how am I going to feel on that day when it comes to it? So the balance of, you know, personal and work is always going to be a struggle. But one thing I would encourage everybody to do is treat your personal commitments, so whether it's vacation, holidays or you know you need some time off get that on the calendar also and treat that no differently than what you would as you're calendarizing your, your work over the next three months six months or a year